New data from Transport for London's revealed that the Victoria Line is the hottest on the London Underground network. The average platform temperature last summer was recorded above 30 degrees. TfL says it's installed new ventilation systems on a number of lines suffering from hot air. Harry Lowe has more. It's official. The Victoria Line is the hottest on the London Underground. Last year, temperatures were in excess of 28 degrees across 2023. And on average, between June and October, the temperature exceeded 30 degrees on this line. Here at Oxford Circus, it's the only place on the network which has all three of the hottest lines. The Victoria Line, followed by the Bakerloo and the Central Line, which used to be the hottest on the London Underground. Ten years ago, the Victoria Line was actually only the fifth warmest on the network, behind the Bakerloo, Central, Piccadilly and Northern Lines. But in the last 10 years, it's gone up on average more than 6 degrees Celsius. Transport for London said it's working hard to make sure its services remain resilient in the face of more frequent and extreme hot weather events. It added, we've implemented energy efficient solutions on new trains, which save energy and reduces the heat generated. It added also that it's increased its ventilation capacity and that it's installed on the central line solar reflective material on train roofs and films on the windows to keep carriages cooler. Oh, and in case you're wondering what the coolest line is, there's four of them. The Metropolitan, Hammersmith and City, Circle and District Line, all of which have air conditioning.